Hello developers, let's continue. As you have noticed that we didn't do anything special or new in compared to Kotlin. We will see that we have done the same as like in Java. What is the difference between Java and Kotlin then? Okay, now see. You have now 63 number of lines. Now we reduce the number of lines. So how can we do this? Whenever you write any code, you have already, you should always notice that there are some suggestions provided by Android Studio. So you always keep in mind that you will need to use this. So first is giving me a suggestion that loop can be replaced with standard library operations. And what is this operation? Just simply tap here and press Alt, Enter. It is saying that you should replace this with first or null. Okay, now your four lines are converted into a single line. As you have noticed that in Java 8, there are some new terms introduced just like stream API, lambda expression. By default, these are provided with the Kotlin. If you want to implement this with the Java, you need to configure Java 8 feature in Android Studio. Okay, but in case of Kotlin, you do not need to do any such customization. Now, what this part is doing fragment is traversing all the element and find out the first element which is not null and then visible to user okay next session is simply go here for press alt enter do you want to replace it with any i will say any okay now you see that we traverse all the element inside this list and find that element which is equal to that class name okay this part it denote the object of this particular inner class okay now we will see that if there are more suggestion or not i will hide this part traverse here traverse here traverse here now there are no more suggestion now the next thing what we can do is we are checking here if fragment is not equal to null then compare this part. So in Kotlin you can be null safe with the help of let keyword. You will say if fragment dot it will be my fragment dot it will say let inside this block now you will check that just cut this part paste it here you don't need to add this particular condition okay it will move inside this block only when this fragment is not null now just simply remove this space move this space now you have seen that your 63 line is reduced to a 53 line so you have reduces the 10 number of lines and your code look little bit easier in compared to previous ones okay now we will just check that is everything working or not now currently i am in home fragment nothing will happen now i am in favorite fragment nothing will happen go to home fragment and favorite fragment okay now you can see that now our every problem is solved we have shown we will adding fragment only at one time to a fragment manager and reduces the code line also so that much for this video if you like the video just comment subscribe to get the latest update regarding new video added just press on bell icon